Pony. So today I'm going to be doing the Vinyl Pop uh, Funko Pop figurine number six, which is Twilight Sparkle. And no, it is not Princess Twilight Sparkle. Uh, this is supposed to be Philly, uh, and a version of the Philly ponies, and she wasn't a princess until she got older. So this is what she looks like inside the package. Back of the package with the other ponies. I purchased this from Entertainment Earth. It was $9.99 on their website. Uh, shipping is very horrible. It took almost two weeks to receive this here. Um, they do ship FedEx, but FedEx actually just brings it to your post office and then the post office does the rest. So it took a little bit longer than expected. Um, so I'm going to open her up to show you a little close up of what she looks like. These are very easy to come out of the package. I open all of them on camera and I keep them back in the box since these are the only ones that I own that are easy to come right on the way back in. So as you can see, it comes right out like this. Very easy to take out of the package. So I'm just going to inspect her really quickly to see if there's any flaws. She has some paint issues on the back where it looked like she they did the blue and then painted the green the purple and the pink on top so it's not very well done. Uh, she's got issues on the side where you can see the purple from the spray paint of this. She's got glue residue on her face. So I mean there is flaws. Thankfully these things are only ten dollars because there is some flaws. First off on the back of her hair she has a purple spot and the purple and the pink are not really done as great. Like that pink there is kind of see-through. Um, you can't really see the glue residue on her face, but she does have glue residue. But those are the only flaws that I see. And a pink spot on her back. But she does display very nicely inside the box, so I'm not too concerned about that. And I know when they mass produce stuff like this, it does get really tough to make sure they're perfect. I can't complain too much. And she's got like a little spot in the end of her hair over here. But I don't, I know that every single one of these that I've opened up always have a flaw. Can't decide why they have flaws, but if you really take a look at them, you can see that this has to be hand painted to be able to get the color in her hair. And if you look where her horn is, there's some bad coloring in there as well. And it's tough, but she's really cute. I mean, the fillies um, are my favorite. I prefer to collect these over the Funko ones, that, the larger versions that I have out right now, like the Derpy, Rainbow Dash, Lyra, and stuff like that, but these are really cute. So this is number six out of seven. So far they do not have Rarity or Applejack they have made. I'm hoping sometime in the future they do. I can't guarantee it because I know nothing, nothing about any of these right here, but hopefully sometime they do make more of them. I could see them doing a whole line of like um, Luna or even Celestia. Um, I could see them making more of these. And if they do, I'll be collecting every single one because I like the fillies. They're adorable. They're really small. They're um, smaller than my hand. So if you don't want them in the box and you just want to display little ones on a shelf, they'd still be cute. Like I said, they're very easy to put right back into the package. And there you go. Just like that. So there you have it. This is Twilight Sparkle number six, the Funko Pop figurines from My Little Pony. Uh, thank you all for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and there'll be more pony videos coming soon. Bye!